fashion shows are still going very strong and we have to see what celebs attended. Okay, for the Hermes fashion show, Taika Waititi actually walked it. Look at that coat. I'm in love with it. And also, I just love seeing a man with like the black and white, you know, kind of salt and pepper hair. It's just, to me, it just shows signs of wisdom. Taylor Fritz also walked in the show. Again, it's the coat for me. Matt Damon and Casey Affleck were in attendance. I mean, both in just very simple, casual looks. Nina Dobrev looks so good with bangs. I love the bangs on her. I think her outfit is adorable. But yeah, the bangs just draw my attention. Tiffany Haddish, I absolutely love the draping on this dress. The color's gorgeous. And I love the little heels that she paired it with. You know, those little pointed toe moments are all the rage right now. If I could raid one woman's sunglasses collection, it would be Natasha Lyonne. She always has on the coolest pair of sunglasses. They're just so 70s, so retro. Her whole look is such a vibe, but yeah, the sunglasses get me every single time. Team Conrad forever. If you read the books, you know why. I'm just saying. But Chris Briney, I mean, very casual. He's actually wearing shorts and as he should. I mean, he lives on a beach, right? Evan Mock is just so cool. He always just looks so cool and effortless. Like he just wakes up and throws on a leather jacket and it's just, that's just who he is. I mean, look at him. Deacon Phillippe, who is the son of Reese Witherspoon and Ryan Phillippe, that is one celebrity couple who I wish had made it because I just love them both so much. But his look is very effortless, super cool. I mean, you can't complain about it. Okay, and over at the Burberry fashion show, look at Kylie Minogue. That green coat, the purple shoes, I mean, it's like a really fun color combination. I also love this print. Love it so much. Rachel Weiss in this two-piece set. Look at the purse, I love it. Um, but honestly, the way it's lined, I kind of thought it was pajamas. At least it's comfortable. Jodie Comer, I think she looks really good. Love the hair and makeup. Very, It looks like a very just simple dress with boots. I mean, I love dresses and boots. It's like the perfect fall combination. Okay, Burna Boy, and this is like the ultimate illusion right here. It really is. It's kind of cool, but if you've had a drink or two, this might look very differently. Okay, talk about a power couple. Rosie Huntington Whitley, Jason Statham. The fact that she's just wearing a trench coat with these amazing shoes and throw on a pair of sunnies, call it a day, and she still looks good. Anything she wears, she looks good. I actually really like this look on Jessie Buckley because it's very British punk and I love it. I think she wears it so well. My favorite part is kind of the vampy lip. I just think when it's done right, it looks so good. Taylor Zachary Perez, and honestly, he should be on the runway. He really should be. He just has the look. Shy Girl, and the only thing I'm not really feeling on this look is the tights. I wish they were more um, like a solid black or even like a smaller fishnet tight, but the larger fishnet tight is just, I don't know, but I do love that Burberry coat. Okay, and last but not least, Joel Kinnaman and Kelly Gale. First of all, her look is amazing. I love it. The tie jacket, it's so good. And again, this print, you know, this is one of my favorite prints. I love it so much. It's gorgeous. Dying to know which look is your fave? If you had one, let's chat in the comments.